Hello gamers, and welcome to a brand new chapter in esports. I'm John Collins for Sormio Esports Channel. Starting today, May 15th, 2016, we'll be bringing you the news, views, and so much more from the world of esports. And today, we are here in Sydney with our parent company, Ubiquay Networks. Uh, and what a better way to kick off an esports channel than a Counter-Strike GO tournament. The tournament is being organized by PvP Gamer Dungeon right here in the heart of Sydney. We're gonna bring you some more about the tournament first, but first I'd like to have a chat with Vijay Karthagesu, uh, founder and CEO of Ubiquay Networks. Vijay, I have some questions to ask you about uh, Swarmio Esports, but first, uh, let's have a chat about Ubiquay. Uh, it's been a year or so since Ubiquay was formally launched. Uh, where are we now? It has been a very exciting year for us. You know, we start with one, two people, and now we are 13 people organization. Uh, we are growing very fast, and we have offices here in Sydney and Toronto. We have data centers in Toronto, Chicago, Seattle, and we are looking at going globally. Mm -hmm. So let me talk a bit about the technology. Um, so we, we developed a technology that can uh, eliminate or optimize lag for applications, so by moving the servers uh, to an optimal geolocation. Uh, so with the technology, we are launching this into gaming industry. Okay. So today, uh, we are very excited to launch Swamio. Swamio is a product for all the gamers. And all the gamers, they can go to Swamio and get the ultimate lagless experience or optimal lag experience mm -hmm. uh, but they, they, they deserve. And so we are excited today to launch Swamio. So can you tell me about some of the benefits that Swarmio will provide and your vision for it? Sure, sure. Uh, so um, today, um, uh, what if somebody wants to play a game, a multiplayer game, mm -hmm. and if the server is in, uh, let's say, in, in San Francisco, and, and there are players playing into that server, the server is static, it doesn't move. So right. whoever closer to that server will have better chance of winning. Of uh, with our technology, we will actually move the server to an optimal location, closer or to an optimal location, so that everybody will have a fair and better gaming experience. Hmm. Uh, so with the Swamio uh, portal, uh, our target is kind of three type of users. Okay. Uh, the first type is the parents. As I'm a parent, mm -hmm. I have uh, three kids and uh, they all, you know, the two of them play. Yeah. Uh, games and the other one is only four months and he will, he will, he will play games there, eventually. Yeah, yeah. Um, I do want some function. So I want my kids to play games safer and secure mm -hmm. and especially online games. So we introduce uh, functionalities like parental controls, uh, rating the game. So I can actually allow my seven year old play games but not R rated games. Okay. So that kind of functionalities we introduce as a parent what I wanted, we actually, uh, we're going to give it to our parents. Uh, the second one is for pro gamers. Uh, so pro gamers, they want the ultimate experience. They mm. want the lowest lag, the powerful servers, and access to all the games, and they have different features that they wanted. Then, you know, one server or multiple servers, they want to have their private parties with their friends, mm -hmm. or they want to host their own tournament, and so that's the pro gamers. The third category is someone like PvP, with the gaming centers, right. uh, or tournament organizers, and who okay. want to organize tournaments. And so they can actually come and rent our arena, or the, mm -hmm. the virtual arena, and host their tournament. And they will have tools like um, uh, uh, management systems. So tournament management system is a big thing for them. So mm -hmm. it's online tournament management systems. They can host now from physical uh, location uh, esports to now as a hybrid model. So they can have a physical tournament okay. location. They can also have a virtual arena, having uh, uh, having a tournament with other another mm -hmm. center, uh, different cities. So we are going to kind of enable them to to grow from their physical location and and merge that physical with virtual, and we're going to give them all the tools. And it's going to be an awesome, awesome photo. Yeah, that's that's very exciting. Yeah. So what about the esports channel? What's your vision for that? Esports is the future of TV, and if you look at millennials, um, uh, they don't watch traditional TV. They don't watch anything traditional. So uh, everything is new, and so esports is growing very fast. So if you look at it today, uh, esports is the second largest viewership in the TV industry. So the first mm -hmm. one is uh, um, uh, the Super Bowl, yep. and second largest is uh, League of Legends esports channel. Yeah. So uh, this is going to be the future. 
and and the gamers are going to be the next generation so we need to give them a medium to share the experience with mm. others so this esports is going to be integrated very well with our swami portal okay. and all the game plays so now they can actually um, broadcast their play or broadcast their tournaments they can have their own own tournament okay. they can create they uh, create their content and and through our channels we will enable them to broadcast to the world through twitch or any other mediums uh, and this is going to be our premium offering for all the all the uh, gamers and is is for them and so we are creating that medium for them to enable uh, create contents and and share the, share with the world Yep, that sounds awesome, Vijay. Thank you very much. Thank you. Uh, we'll be having a chat with Todd Chant later, who is the founder of PvP Gamer Dungeon. Uh, but before that, let's head back to the action.